my name is Brittany Lee Saunders and in today's video I'm going to be trying out a bunch of different American candy and like some chips and stuff like that. So one of my subscribers named Sarah was kind enough to send me a big box of stuff. Um, so thank you so much Sarah for making this video possible. I love you for sending me these things to try because it makes a whole video for me but I also kind of hate you because you're ruining my diet. But I'm just gonna have a bit of a YOLO moment and we're gonna say just do it for the video. You know how they say do it for the vine? Well, we're just doing it for the video here today. And I'm just gonna get straight on to it. So sit back, relax, enjoy this video. And if you wanna see more videos like this on my channel, make sure to give this video a thumbs up for me so that I know. So the first thing that I'm gonna be trying is the Tootsie Roll. I've heard about these so many times, but I actually have no idea what it is. Looks like this. It looks like a big log of shit, pretty much. Smells like caramel. I can't really taste it that much, to be honest. It tastes like rubber and plastic with a tiny bit of like caramel or chocolate. Okay, officially, I'm disappointed by the Tootsie Roll. Like, what even is that? Next, I'm gonna move on to the Flamin' Hot Cheetos. Let's see how hot they actually are. Yeah, they're pretty hot, I guess, but not extremely hot or anything. They're pretty good. Might just have to continue eating them once this video is over. Okay, the next thing I've got is a three pack of Pop Rocks. I've heard many things about these in movies and stuff like that, um, but I've never had them. So there's strawberry, watermelon, and tropical punch. They look like this. Let's start with the watermelon. I'm trying to figure out what the best way to go about this is. Do I just tip it in my mouth? Is that gonna be the most practical way? Can you guys hear that? Well, they definitely pop. Okay, next one, strawberry. Jeez. I can't say I would ever buy these and like go out of my way to buy them and enjoy the taste of them, but I can see how kids would find these like absolutely amazing. And the last one's Tropical Punch. I can see steam coming off them. Holy shit, it just exploded out of my mouth. Well, that was fun. I'm gonna have to say the best flavor was definitely watermelon. Next thing I have is Funny Funny Uns onion flavored rings. I've never had onion rings in my life. Like, I'm pretty sure we have them here in Australia. That's tasty. Doesn't taste like onion. I'm not the biggest fan of onion, so when I see things that are like onion flavored, I'm like, ew, but like, this doesn't even taste like onion. Ew, onion rings. The next thing I have here is um, fruit stripe, and it's got a little zebra on the front. Um, and it says tattoos inside. Collect all ten. Wet them and wear them. So this must be another kids thing. What is this? Chewing gum? I think it is, actually. Wow. We'll start off with green. This is a tattoo. Where's the tattoo? Is that the tattoo? <laughs> anyway. Tastes like a Victoria's Secret body spray. Okay, well that was yum, but I'm not gonna go and try another four flavors of chewing gum just because I don't really see the point. Sarah has also sent me some crispy M&Ms. Um, we actually have crispy M&Ms in Australia. I don't know if these are the same or different, but either way, I like M&Ms, so I'm gonna eat some in this video. They look the same. Seriously, when I have M&Ms, I just wanna go. I love how they write on the packet 180 calories per serving. Is it like, are they trying to make you feel good about eating M&Ms or like not bad about eating M&Ms? Only 180 calories of sugar. Love M&Ms, can't fault them. We do have those here in Australia, but I'm guessing Sarah thought that maybe we did. She sent me a couple of Slim Jims, which I have heard the name before. And to me, it looks like a Twiggy stick or a beef something smoked snack stick. Let's give a Slim Jims a go. Oh, yum! That smells really good. Ew! I don't like the outside feeling of it. I mean, it tastes good. But the outside bit, it's got a weird kind of... I'm put off by the texture of the outside, though. 
The next thing Sarah sent me is some Warheads Sour Dippin' Pucker Packs. And they've got four different flavors here, so let's try Sour Watermelon first. Comes with like one of those lolly sticks, so. Mmm. Oh. <laughs> I thought this was gonna have like a thing that you lick it and then dip it in there. <laughs> but it has nothing in there, it's just this. Okay. Jesus. Dippin'. Oh, right. I'm a fucking idiot. Okay, so the stick's in one side and the dippy bit is in the other. I'm an idiot. Okay, so the stick is sour watermelon and the stuff is green apple. It tastes pretty good to me. Are there any like lollies or candy in this world that's actually sour? Like, you know how they say sour, but it's never sour? So this one's sour blue raspberry stick and sour cherry powder. These are really yum. There we go. Oh shit, I'm dropping it everywhere. Dayom. 10 out of 10 to the Warheads thing. I got one more thing left to try and I'm gonna wash it all down with some Doritos. Cool Ranch. Interesting. They just smell like normal Doritos but not very flavoured. Oh wow. I'm kind of got a mix of Warhead flavour and Cool Ranch dressing, but you can definitely taste ranch dressing in that, which I think is cool. And there you have it you guys, that is my video. That is it. That is all there is. There isn't any more. This has been a bunch of fun to film and I've probably consumed my weekly calories just in the past 15 minutes of my life. I'm gonna say the most disappointing one that I was like expecting to be nicer than it was was definitely the Tootsie Roll. What the hell is this? Do people actually buy this over there? Like, ew. Anyways guys, that's all I have for today's video. Big shout out to Sarah for sending me this box of goodies to try. I hope you guys have enjoyed watching. Make sure to give this video a massive thumbs up for me if you did. You guys are awesome and I'll see you in my next video which will be sometime in the very near future. Peace out doggies.